This is my first episode from the sampling series. And what other better way to do it? This is zoologist. If there would be such thing as niche to niche, this would be it. This is the way samples are shipped. This is their presentation. And look at it. It's gorgeous, gorgeous. One of the best samples presentations I've seen in my entire life. These are actually fucking amazing. The quality of the presentation in these is just top notch. I don't think there would be another thing you could wish for. So here they are. These are my five samples. Zoologist has other fragrances in their portfolio. So you can always check those out. Check the official website. I will start off with the rhinoceros. The artwork is amazing in these. Inside it shows you the notes. The same thing is going on with all of these. This is the bat. It shows you the notes and a little story about the fragrance. This is hummingbird. This is beaver. All of these are Eau de Parfum concentration. And this right here, and this is Panda. Amazing, amazing artwork and presentation from Zoologist. Even if the presentation is top notch, the quality of the juices is way, way better. If you can imagine that. So, you have presentation and really off the wall quality juice. I don't even need to take my hand to my nose to smell. Man, this is really... Yeah, it's something else. Something entirely, entirely else. Let me go for for beaver. Man, this... Wow. Now, if, if you've noticed, I went for, I don't know, two, three sprays, but I don't, I don't need to take my hand to, to the nose to smell it. It's all over. Leathery, boozy, rough, combined with sweetness. This right here can take on any leather fragrance from whatever niche house or designer, whatever price. This right here is beaver. Beaver contains, uh, from what I remember, it contains castorium. Let me see it. Okay, here it is, castorium. Now, zoologist fragrances do contain a lot of notes. And they are blended to perfection. Beaver, I think, just made it in my all-time favorites. Might be hard to pull off because this is not for any occasion, but... It's definitely a unique smell. The light citrus on top, yeah, it's the wood and musk at the base. It's phenomenal. I'm really curious if if you guys got to smell the the zoologist portfolio. Let me go for the bat. But to me. This is just impressive and stunning work. Amazing sprayer on the... Man, yeah, definitely. I can already smell it. This doesn't happen very often. You, you just don't even have to take the, the hand to your, to your nose to smell it. This has fruits on top, maybe? Yeah, yeah, look, right here. At this moment, I do, do not own a bottle, but... I think I, I will. So, if you've seen the Spice Bomb vs. Men in Black video that I have on my channel, definitely a full bottle of Zoologist is coming to me and will take part of in one of those videos. Those one filmed outside with nice special effects, with text floating over, hummingbird. It's obvious that the hummingbird would go for flower notes. From what I know, a hummingbird has been uh, reformulated 
I don't know what's the difference between those, but you can check the official website. And this right here is Panda. I've never been to a bamboo forest, but this smells green, woody, fresh, airy. Thank you very much for watching the first episode from my sampling series. And I will see you in my next one. Goodbye.